What does it take to make nature and cultural heritage come alive? In spring, three groups of students from Seattle, Mount Vernon, Bellingham, and New Halem, Washington, loaded up on buses to do just that at the third annual Migratory Bird Festival at Evie's Landing on Whidbey Island. Here, specialists from the North Cascades Institute and the Forest Service took about 80 youth and 15 elders touring four distinctive wildlife habitats and a historical lighthouse on the Evie's Landing National Historic Reserve to find out just what it takes to be a migrating bird. In one group activity, participants experience migration from a bird's perspective. Here, they are learning what are the resources that birds need, what makes up quality habitat, Everyone plays in an interactive game and pretends to be a bird along the migratory pathways. The funniest thing I did in the festival was when we saw all the birds. Youth go on an expedition to look for migratory shorebirds along Crockett Lake. Migratory shorebirds are arriving from as far south as South America, while ducks that have been here all year are preparing to leave for the Arctic, Canada and Alaska. It is the perfect time of the year to be here. The hardest thing we did was that we had to try to look for a bird that was like all moving, uh, trying to catch a mice. A hike up to Admiralty Head Lighthouse perched atop a high sea bluff gives a viewpoint to scan the waters below for seabirds, marine life, and migratory shorebirds. On January 21st, 1861, the lighthouse pierced the night for the first time, guiding thousands of ships into Puget Sound for over 61 years of service. A short walk along the beach offers a chance to play. Some of the seabirds and wildlife they can see along the way are surf scooters, common golden eye, western sandpipers, bald eagles, as well as orca and gray whales and sea lions, if they are lucky. The grossest thing I saw was the fish that was in the ground and wasn't moving. One of the ways nature comes alive is through touch. The marine lab touch tanks house giant Pacific octopus, scallops, crabs, and some of the really cool invertebrates that make up the basis of the food web that feed migratory birds along their arduous journey. The grossest thing is when I um, got to hold, um, I didn't know what it was until he told me the slug. The thing that I liked the most about the bird festival was that we got to meet new people and communicate with them. It was amazing. 